నో నో వెయిట్ వెయిట్ నేను చెప్తాను నేను చెప్తాను థ్యాంక్ యూ సో మచ్ ప్రశాంత్ నమస్తే గుడ్ మార్నింగ్ గుడ్ ఆఫ్టర్నూన్ గుడ్ ఈవినింగ్ ఫర్ ఆల్ ద టీడీ పీప్స్ వాచింగ్ ఫ్రమ్ అక్రాస్ ద గ్లోబ్ దిస్ ఇస్ అవర్ హోమ్ ఇన్ ఇండియా ద వెరీ ఓన్ టీడీసీఎక్స్ ఆఫీసెస్ ఇన్ హైదరాబాద్ అండ్ యాజ్ వీ వాక్ ఇన్ one of the first spaces that you're seeing is our reception area and this is where we make our guests feel at home and this is a lovely area and i'm sure some of you might have seen in one of those linkedin wallpapers that we have already put in thanks to our marketing teams for doing some of those things and uh, as we walk in i think uh, one thing that you will see across our offices is the rich culture the heritage the tradition that india as a country brings along and what we have done is we have tried to put some of those elements across our office spaces and one of the things that we have done is use some of our local artisans to build some hand painted walls and let me take you through one of those hand painted walls to depict something very very important to us in india music music is a sentiment it's an emotion for all indians and the, on the wall that you see this is actually hand painted by our local artisans and you will see some of the traditional indian musical instruments like the sitar the violin the beena the tabla and a lot of them and most of them are used in lot of occasions whether it is your family gatherings your marriages and stuff music as i said is something that every indian loves and you will see that in the variety of music that goes through in, as you travel along the different parts of this beautiful country let me take you through our next one which is a, one of our training rooms this is an, a lovely room where we expect a lot of our td peeps going through the training programs and becoming a better version of themselves as we walk out i talked to you a little bit about the music but another form that we indians absolutely love is dance dance is a form of expression for us we just love to dance doesn't matter what the occasion is and as i am walking you through let me also show you one of those again intricately designed walls which depicts a lot of our dance forms in the country whether it is the kathakali from the south we talking about the jhumar from haryana in the north the rauf from kashmir which is a northernmost part of the country or we are talking about the bhangra which is not only popular in india but is popular globally we indians just need an occasion and we are there we will dance it out as we move on let me take you to an important room that we have which is our board room this is where a lot of our leadership meetings happen this is where a lot of decisions are taken and this is a lovely room for some of the leadership here and guys how are you very well sir are you liking this room very much i know this is a beautifully built big room right yes sir thank you so much for joining in right. thank you as we walked in i'm sure you would have seen that you know there is a lot of greenery around be greener be kinder remember those concepts we have a lot of plants spread across and go green it's just not about putting up plants it's about a concept a priority for us in india that we want to walk through by going green by building that whole sustainability around and you will see a lot of those elements as we walk through different parts of the office we have different sets of plants different kinds of and it not only helps in design but also in the overall go green concept as well now we are walking into some of our workstations and as we walk in this is one important wall that i really want to show you this is the wall of fame people across the globe from tdcx have helped build this office it was just not us this team but this entire people from across the globe and it talks a lot about the culture of collaboration the culture when we say welcome home what we really mean we really mean welcoming home and these individuals from across the globe have not only helped each of our team members but have also been there on moments that we needed their help on and that is a, that talks a lot about the kind of collaboration in the culture this organization brings in and for those of you who have tuned in now watching me and for those of you who have not from the bottom of part of my heart i wanted to say thank you namaste so much namaste let me take you through uh, you know the other parts of this we i showed you the board room i showed you the training room but one important area is our uh, entire meeting rooms and what we try to do is name each of these meeting rooms after some of the important cities in the country and what better way to start other than our very own home in india hyderabad hi khushboo hi khushboo hi everyone hi. this is a lovely meeting room isn't it yeah, yeah. i i'm hoping you're liking it here yes. 
This is where I also do a lot of uh, you know, the meetings. Some of you might have seen the background when we do our MS Teams or the Zoom meetings that we do over various days. So this is a lovely meeting room and thank you people for being around. Now, you will also see that across the offices, we have built in some of those informal spaces, right? And this is one such space where we expect people to come, talk, socialize, get to know each other. And you will see that spread across some other parts of the offices as well. Now, let me take you through some of the places where, you know, there are more workstations where people, uh, you know, what would wa will be working on. And one such area is this part of our office. You will see, we are waiting for a lot of our TD peeps to come join us, have this area buzzing with a lot of activity. And as we walk through, I'm sure you're seeing that this, the concept of greenery that I talked to you about is continuing in this part of the office as well. And you remember those meeting rooms that I talked to you about different cities? You will see one such here as well. This, this part is our national capital, Delhi. This is another one of those meeting, lovely meeting rooms. You know, and you'll see more such cities coming up as we move in. As we walk out, let me take you through some other parts of this lovely office space, right? So one such thing is, the next part that I would like to show you is our director's office. Hi, Byron. Hey, hi, Sudhi. Thank you so much, Byron, for coming in from Malaysia, flying in, and for this important occasion of ours. Oh, it's my pleasure. And what a beautiful office. It is. Have. I see you're showing it off to people. Too. I am. We're yeah. taking every occasion to show off this beautifully designed office. What do you want to say a quick word to sure. all our TD peeps? You know, thank you so much to all of you for tuning in and for taking a look at this beautiful office. I hope you enjoy the rest of the tour with Sudeep. Back to you, Sudeep. Thank you, Biden. We'll catch you soon. Most welcome. As we walk out, I think one of the important elements that I really want to call out is the kind of hard work and the toil that each of the individuals here have put in, in coming up with some of those intricate parts of this office. The, the designs, the areas designed, the color schemes, the kind of, you know, the uh, chairs. It might just seem about a few furnitures and a few walls, but each of them designing, you know, and coming up with those concepts is not easy work. And a lot of our people in India have helped us and also some of the you know individuals from across the globe in putting this lovely office together in designing each intricate part of it and as we move along let me also you know take you through some other areas of this office but one such part is these are our electrical cabins this is where a lot of our electricals are but what we try to do is maybe look make it look or even more beautiful. And you will see an extremely colorful wall out here depicting some of the kites. And kite is flying is a very you know old tradition in India. And it's just not about flying these colorful kites, but it is also about an important part. As you might know, India is an agriculture economy, and Uttarayan is one such festival that happens in January or in February. And that's where you know we do, do fly kites enjoying that particular part, and every farmer loves that part of the year in their lives. As I walk through, let me also pass it on to my colleague to take you through the remaining part of the office. But let me give you a very, very important fun fact. As I pass on to Anant, Anant and Prashant were our first, were our first employees who started in TDC Accenture. Anand, thank you so much. And over to you for the rest of the tour. Thank you, Sudeep. Uh, and yes, I consider myself really fortunate for having been able to witness the site being built ground up from just a shell to what we're seeing right now. And uh, the entire journey was very exciting, you know, every bit of it as every wall was being built, as every duct was being put. I've been there, I've seen that and so I know what it actually means to actually set an office up. Just to give you some background, I've never worked in a company which was not set up already. So this has been a really interesting experience for me. So this is another meeting room. It's named after our financial capital, Mumbai, also known as the City of Dreams. You guys might know this better as Bollywood. Let's take a quick peek inside. Hi, Ravi. Hi, Anand. So it's your third day at office. How's it going? Yeah, it's going great. Great, great. Continue. Thank you. Have fun. Great. So and this, my friends, is the DG Lab, where we have some of our brightest minds brainstorm and come up with the most innovative ideas. Hello, guys. I hope you're all enjoying your day. Yeah. Great. Thank you. Now, 
Sudeep did mention about a lot of agile spaces, a lot of casual seating, etc. What you see there is also a bean bag setup, which is for the team to actually relax, chill, and, and catch up during work as well. So, given the strict lockdown that extended into the first half of 2021, uh, unfortunately, our leaders couldn't visit us during the initial setup phase. But to make up for that, we right now have our very own Byron Fernandez here with us, gracing us with his presence. Uh, we are partly excited also because we got to know that Byron was not an augmented reality, uh, you know, something that was created by our DigiLab team. And this is the learning and development area. Now, this is where we collaborate and design some of the most interesting training programs for our future leaders. This area is also very Instagrammable. I mean, if you look at the entire office, it's very Instagrammable, but uh, most of our photo ops happen over here. Now, clothing in India encompasses a wide variety of uh, ethnicities and cultural traditions. There are over 19,500 languages and dialects spoken in India. So, you understand when I say that there is a lot of different cultures that is being followed across in each of these states. This wall depicts a lot of uh, clothing traditions that we follow in the various states in India. Now, we have something from the mundus to the kurtas and pajamas to the saris, etc. So, what I'm wearing right now is a kurta and pajama and we have a beautiful Roshni draped in a sari. These are very traditional dresses across India. I'll take you to a few other places as well. And uh, when we started off, obviously, there's a lot of construction work happening, there's a lot of fit out happening and we couldn't host our meetings here. So, Prashant and I were mostly in, in cafes in and around Hyderabad. Uh, I think partly also because we, you know, we enjoy being to the cafes, but we realized that we created our cafeteria. Probably it is inspired by uh, the various cafes that we've been to as well. I'll take you there in a bit, but as we head to the cafeteria, we have another meeting room over here. It's named after our city of joy, Kolkata. And uh, TD peeps, let me welcome you to our very own cafeteria. This is our beautiful cafe-like setup cafeteria. Now, in India, we derive our happiness from our food. Uh, we love our biryanis and butter chicken. And here in our cafeteria, we see that this wall depicts a misogyny of Indian culinary experience and food typologies. What we see here is our khao gali or our eat street. Let me also remind you that uh, India is the second largest producer of tea in the world. And about 90% of that is actually consumed internally. So, you know how serious I am when I tell you that we love our chai. And we also have centers over here with a lot of quick uh, pick-me-up cups over here that you'd see in our very own coffee station. And uh, ladies and gentlemen, I'd like to thank you for the time that you spent over here. Uh, I hope you enjoy the office as much as we do. We love our office. Prashant, over to you.